Well, Extend and Stay Hotel represent about 10% of the hotel market in America and has seen a success uh, throughout the last especially 30 years. And one of the most important thing about Extend and Stay is that through the cycles, especially on downturn cycles, is the only uh, hotel segment that actually performed well compared to other segments. We've seen the lack of this um, our, um, the supply in Europe uh, about 10 years ago. And because we had an experience uh, as collectively among us and Saikas Hospitality about extended stay, we have decided to roll out uh, uh, branded extended stay hotels on behalf of Intercontinental Hotel Group as well as Marriott and now we're doing Hyatt. Basically um, certain projects that where we need to increase the value of the asset by filling up the uh, envelope of the building, especially in the new development, anything you know uh, about over 6,000 square meter it's, uh, it's too big for a standalone extended stay hotel. So that's where we play in either, depending on the market, we can choose to do a lifestyle hotel or a full service hotel. So currently uh, we have a Holiday Inn and Stay Bridge. We have a Crown Plaza and Stay Bridge, which complements each other <clears throat> great. And my next opening is a Moxie and Residence Inn in Amsterdam. And I have another two Moxie and Residence Inn combinations going into construction, one in the UK and one also in Netherlands in The Hague.